Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and let's get right into today's video. So for today's video, I do have some of the new Double Dip Nails Dip Powders. This is the Mickey Mouse Collection. This is a brand new collection and these are limited edition dip powders. So once these sell out, they are not coming back in stock. Today I am going to be swatching them as dip powder and acrylic and then also using one of these colors to do a acrylic nail set. There are 13 dip powder colors in this collection and they are glitter, glitter, glitter. These colors are all so beautiful and I'm, I'm so excited to show you guys the beautiful colors in this collection. Like I said, there are 13 different glitter dip powders in this collection. These can be used as dip powders, acrylic, or you can also use them to ombre. So I will be showing the swatches both as acrylic and dip powder. So here are the 13 colors. They also have the cutest names, very Disney themed and Mickey Mouse themed names. I really love this collection and I think if you love glitter or Mickey Mouse, you definitely need to pick up some of these colors or the entire collection. I will be doing a giveaway on a few of these dip powders, so make sure you continue watching if you do wanna hear how to enter. So the first one, we have MK01, Mickey's Clubhouse. This is a beautiful, fine gold glitter with some chunkier blue, pink, and purple. And then, of course, all of these do have Mickey sequins. MK02, Love Mini. This is a beautiful pink glitter mix with iridescent, purple, chunky, and fine glitter. I love this one. These are all so beautiful. MK030 Toodles. See, look at how cute these names are. I love it. And this one is kind of a mixture of glitters, again, having the chunky and fine glitters and the super cute Mickey Mouse ear sequins. Very cute. I love it. The next one is MK04 Clarabelle. And this one actually is a orange based dip powder. I'm pretty sure it it I'm pretty sure it has like an orange pigment in it because the dip powder does show up more orange, but it also has fine and chunky glitter. This one is MK05 Daisy Duck, which also I believe has a purple pigment in it. Um, as you can see there, it's more of a purple with also chunky glitters in it. MK06 Disney Dreams. These are all so beautiful. I love them. This one has like a, I feel like it has kind of like a white base with chunky and then also fine purple glitter. MK07 Goofy. This one has a very pretty blue color to it. I love this one. I love the fine blue glitter and then the like colorful chunky glitter. MK08 Mystery Mouse Catool. And this one is a another beautiful glitter. I really love this one though because it has a lot of different color in it. I love how it has like green, blue, yellow, pink. MK09 Minis Boutique. This is the one I did use in today's nail set. This one is a beautiful purple with teal and pink glitter. MK10 Pluto. This one is more of a green themed glitter having green, yellow, and like orange red glitter. Super beautiful. This one is MK011, even though it doesn't have the number, and this one I believe was Carousel. This again, having the fine and the chunky glitter, super beautiful with a mix of colors. MK12 Pink Dust, another beautiful pink one. This one has a nice mixture as well. All of these really just have a beautiful mixture of glitter and they all the glitter just goes so well in each of these 
And last but not least, MK13 Flying Dumbo, which has a red pigment along with chunky and fine glitters. Here is a closer look at all 13 of these all-in-one powders, which can be used again as dip powder or acrylic, and you can also use them for different things like ombreing. So I am going to go ahead and show the swatches of dip powder. I did swatch them off camera. I did two coats of the dip powder using the dip base and the activator. I will be showing the tops and the undersides of the swatch stick just because these dip powders are full of glitter. It is kind of hard to see them on a small swatch stick. So on the underside, you really can see those Mickey Mouse sequins, which is the star of these dip powders. These four colors here, very beautiful. I love the orange pink theme here we have some blue and purple dip powder colors in this collection really love these ones i absolutely love the blue themed one i don't know i love blue and that one is just so beautiful to me i really truly love this collection and here we have the last five colors we have a purple green gold pink and a red all of these colors are super beautiful. Again, these are limited edition and once they sell out, they are not coming back in stock. So if you are interested in any of the 13 or all of the 13, make sure you do check the description box below. I do have a discount code with Double Dip Nails where you can save 20% off your entire purchase. And that code is Brandy20. I will be linking these dip powders below in the description box. Don't forget, these also can be used as acrylic, so I am going to be going ahead and swatching them using the Double Dip No MMA Liquid Monomer. I'm just going to be putting some of this into my dampen dish, and then I will be swatching the acrylic swatches on a paper towel. I just feel like when I swatch acrylic glitter powders swatching them on a paper towel i feel like that really helps with showing all of the different types of glitter and honestly this was so satisfying and so beautiful i am going to go ahead and let this play out but just go ahead sit back relax and enjoy the swatching So here are the 13 colors swatched as acrylic. I love these. They are definitely full of glitter and I love the Mickey Mouse sequins being in every single one of them. These are so cute and I think they go so nicely together. I was going to do a full nail set using all of like a different one on each of the fingers, but I did decide just to use one of the colors and of course I will be coming back to these because they are extremely beautiful. Beautiful. 
I did go ahead apply my peel off base coat and then I also applied some square half cover nail tips and cut them down to the length that I wanted and did some filing and buffing to the nails and now we are ready to do the nail set. I am going to be using MK09 Minis Boutique and 243 Pansy for this nail set today. I thought these colors paired really nicely together. Like I said, I was going to use the, just the collection of dip powders and use like five different ones on each finger, but I did really want to do like the super trendy rhinestone like Mickey Mouse thing you'll see once I add that on so that is the reason why I decided I would use one color and then on my ring finger I would do the color that went with the glitter for example I'm doing the purple glitter with a purple dip powder and of course using these as acrylic I am using the double dip monomer to work with these and I'm just taking my bead of acrylic and patting it on to the nail I guess you would say um, the glitter was a little bit difficult to work with but honestly it stayed in place and I didn't really have any troubles with it just because I did choose to do a shorter nail and there was a lot of glitter it was just a little bit harder to make sure I had the glitter covering the entire nail but trying not to get it on my skin or overhang the nail tip so I did try my best and I did work with it very slowly to make sure the entire nail was covered I didn't have any empty spaces or anything like that and I just wanted to make sure the nail was a full glitter nail also I did try to go in and place some of the Mickey Mouse sequins specifically that way those would be showing and that worked out really well. I would just like kind of like form the nail and then once I had it where I liked it, I did just go in and tap in like some of the mini Mickey Mouse sequins and that worked so perfectly. Like I really love that. And then I'm not building the nail with this glitter acrylic. I will be going in with the 000 clear base and I will be using that to build the nails and give them their structure. Just look at how beautiful, while I was working on these nails, I was so in love with them and I thought they were turning out very beautiful. I can't wait to come back and use the rest of these colors. Next time I use these colors, I will definitely be doing them on longer nails. I don't even know why I chose to do short nails, but it's all right because next time I'm definitely doing long nails and I feel like I want to do five colors on each nail just because I want to have it be a super fun nail set. While I'm continuing to work on the application, I am going to be talking about the Mickey Mouse Dip Powder giveaway, the requirements, and the rules to enter. So if you are still watching, thank you. Now you are going to hear the rules to enter. But first, I do want to say that Double Dip Nails is sponsoring this giveaway. So thank you, thank you so much for sponsoring today's giveaway. For the giveaway, I will be giving away 6 out of the 13 Mickey Mouse Dip Powder colors. If you do win this giveaway, you will be able to choose 6 out of the 13 and Double Dip Nails will send you the 6 you choose. The requirements for this giveaway, you must be 18 years or older and you must have a United States shipping address. For the actual giveaway rules it is very simple rule one you do need to be subscribed to my youtube channel rule two because double dip nails is sponsoring this giveaway you need to go ahead and follow their instagram i will link it down below in the description box rule three you do need to give this video a thumbs up and the last rule you do need to comment below done so I will give this giveaway one week and then I will be choosing and announcing the winner on July 13th, which is next Wednesday. 
And to be able to know if you are the winner, I will be posting it on my con community tab here on YouTube. And I will probably also be announcing it in a YouTube video. So another thing I do suggest is turning on your post notifications. That way when I do upload or when I post that onto my community tab, you will get a notification and you can see right away if you win. I will give the winner 24 hours to respond and if you don't respond back to me within that 24 hours, I will have to choose another winner. So that is why I do recommend turning on your post notifications. That is not a rule to enter, but definitely it is recommended. So as you can see, I finished up with the glitter dip powder. Now I'm just going in with the purple acrylic. I call it dip powder and acrylic throughout the whole video. So I do apologize for that if that is confusing, but just know these are all in one powders. They can be used as dip powder and they can also be used as acrylic powder. And this is the last nail here, so I am just finishing up with that, and then I will be clear capping all of the nails but this purple nail here. So I'm using the Clear Base 000. This is actually a very nice clear. I really like using it, and I'm just going to show my index finger here on camera because it is a repetitive process, I'm, and I just repeated the same exact thing on the other nails. So after I am finished, here is the acrylic application. I feel like when I do shorter nails, the application always comes out a lot cleaner and I just feel like the filing goes by super quick. So I, I feel like I'm improving with acrylic, but I'm improving first with shorter nails and I feel like I will just get better like I did with poly gel. I feel like I can always do my shorter poly gel nails better than the longer ones, but as I continue doing it, I just feel like I get a lot better and I feel like that's going to happen the same way with acrylic powder. So I am now taking my 100 180 grit hand file and I'm just going to be doing some quick filing and shaping to the nails. And then I am going to be going in with the Be Bellavina Professional 2022 e-file. I do have a review of this nail drill up on my channel. So if you do want to watch that, I will have it linked up in the cards. Also, if you are looking for a good e-file, this one is available on the Double Dip website and I actually have a discount code where you can save 40% off this brand new e-file and that code is BRANDY40. Make sure you check the description box if you are interested. I'm just taking a fine grit sanding band keeping my drill on a pretty low speed because these nails are short and not super bulky, so I don't want to over file. And I'm just taking this along the nail to make sure the nail is smooth and also sealing in the cuticle. After I am all finished filing, here are how the nails are looking. I also went ahead and buffed the nails off camera. And now I'm going to be taking my Bellavina top coat. This top coat is included in all of their poly gel kits, but my favorite one will be linked below. And I'm just going to be applying this to all of the nails and then curing for 30 seconds in my nail lamp. This was super satisfying to apply to the glitter nails just because the glitter nails are complete glitter nails. Like they are packed with glitter and I just thought this was super satisfying to watch. Thank you. 
after curing that top coat, this is the whole reason why I didn't do all of the nails a different color, just because I wanted to go in with some AB flat back rhinestones using a larger one for Mickey's face and then two smaller ones for Mickey's ears. I just think this is super cute and super trendy, especially with Disney Mickey Mouse nails, and I haven't done it yet. At least I don't think I have. I don't think I have, but either way, I just, I really wanted to do this, especially because these dip powders are, of course, the Mickey Mouse collection, so I just had to do this, so I used some rhinestone glue, put those in where I like the placement, and then I cured for 30 seconds. Now I am going to be topping this nail set off with some of the double dip cuticle oil. I really like this cuticle oil. It is very nourishing and of course, like I always say, it tops off the nail set and makes them pop. After applying that, I did go ahead and rub them into my cuticles. And then here is the finished look. I really love this nail set. I feel like I haven't done a purple nail set in a while. I think these are super cute. I really love the shape and the length. I think this is super cute and something different for me. Here are the colors one last time. Make sure you do enter the giveaway because I will be choosing the winner next Wednesday. The color I used today was MK09 Minis Boutique. But here are the 13 colors in this collection. They will be linked down below if you do want to end up purchasing them. They are limited edition colors and once they sell out, they will not be coming back in stock. So if you want them, you go sis and go to Double Dip Nails and make a purchase. But as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and I will see you all next time.